Costing a total of £6.4 billion, the UK's two aircraft carriers are the most expensive warships ever built for the Royal Navy. HMS Queen Elizabeth and HMS Prince of Wales are the nation's first carriers for a decade, each with a lifespan of 50 years. But they won't operate alone, each will be escorted by its own carrier strike group, a small armada of vessels that will form a defensive ring. At the centre is the carrier itself, fitted with its own defensive weapons and with capacity to operate 36 F-35B jump jets at any one time. Surrounding her will be the outer ring of the strike group, a formation of other ships and submarines. What it will comprise will depend on the mission. This year, HMS Queen Elizabeth will set sail on its first operational deployment. Her strike group is expected to include a number of different vessels. Two Type 45 destroyers for air defence, two Type 23 frigates for anti-submarine warfare, a nuclear attack submarine, a Royal Fleet Auxiliary fuel tanker to keep her two gas turbine and four diesel engines running, and another RFA supply ship likely to be Fort Victoria to provide food and other stores. The carrier strike group is also likely to have an international element, with ships from other allied nations joining the formation. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.